my friendly neighborhood. It's been so long. I miss it so much. Norman and his stupid line of dialogue. Hey, yo, I'm Norman. And then how long are we supposed to wait for chapter three of Poppy Playtime? Winter 2023, what does that even mean? I just wish. I just wish that there was a mascot horror game to fill the void in between. Hmm. What is that? Joyville? You know, this this might just be able to do it for me. Perfectly in sync. Oh my god! I was just trying to do my intro, but then, holy fuck! Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That caught me off guard with the. Do, 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 do. <laughs> All right, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Sorry. Hey yo, what's poppin'? Party people, I'm that one dude, Chris from YouTube, and welcome to Joyville. I was looking for a new mascot horror game to fill the void in between my friendly neighborhood and the wait for Poppy Playtime Chapter Three, and I came across Joyville. Everybody's been playing it. It's uh, it's like about 30 minutes of playtime. Probably an hour for me, considering I'm doing this right now. <laughs> and I, I honestly, other than that, don't know anything else about this game, other than the fact that it's a new mascot horror game. The mascot of the game looks creepy as hell. He's got teeth and then eyes. And without further ado, let's hop right into this shit. Uh, Y'all see him? Y'all see him? Exit level B1. Okay. Wool, woolly bully? Oh, uh, is that our... You're not Huggy Wuggy. You're not Huggy Wuggy. Oh, there's a run button, of course. Caution and attentiveness are your paths to workplace safety. What if I don't want to be attentive? What if I don't want to be cautious? Uh, there's a lot of reading. Arrested Harrison Vanderbilt. The founder of Joyville was arrested. He looks like Tom Hanks. Kinda. Shocking discovery at Joyville. The situation has taken an ever darker, even darker turn. When authorities arrived at the kindergarten compound following Vanderbilt's arrest, they were met with an unsettling scene of emptiness and abandonment. Not a single child or employee was found, and the compound appeared to have been abruptly vacated leaving behind an air of mystery and foreboding. The community is now left ga graphing with the dis discernment. Di Guys, I'm sorry. If this is your first time watching my videos, I, I kind of can't. Disconcerting question of what has become of these missing children and employees. Distraught parents arrived at the kindergarten expecting to pick up their children as usual, only to discover locked doors and an inexplicable absence. Their frantic inquiries to law enforcement and the authorities have yielded scant information with silence surrounding the whereabouts. Do I want to read all this down here as well? In a deeply unsettling turn of events, local businessman Harrison Vanderbilt, founder of the widely popular Joyville, has been arrested under mysterious circumstances that have left the community shaken while authorities remain tight-lipped tight about the true nature of Vanderbilt's crimes. Speculations and concerns among the public con continue to grow. Vanderbilt, a well-known entrepreneur with a reputation of innovation and success, had earned the trust of numerous parents who eagerly sent their children to Joyville. The facility was initially seen as a safe haven, a place where kids could learn, play, and make memories during the long summer months. However, the shocking truth behind Vanderbilt's activities has shattered this perception, raising alarming questions about the safety of children under his care. Disturbing reports have emerged from anonymous sources within law enforcement, indicating that all children from Joyville are missing. The details of these, however, remain concealed by the authorities, leaving parents and the wider community in the dark regarding the extent of and the extent of the harm inflicted upon these innocent youngsters. The secrecy surrounding Vanderbilt's arrest has sparked intense speculation and outrage amongst concerned citizens. The lack of transparency from law enforcement and 
fueled conspiracy theories and heightened concerns that may be a larger cover-up at play. Parents of this parents of these children have expressed frustration and anguish at the perceived lack of urgency in bringing the bringing to light the full scope of Manderbilt's reprehensible actions. Wow. This guy is kind of fucked. So, he was running a facility that was meant to Oh yeah, these claws these claws are there. Oh, wait. Can can you stop flickering for a second, please? <clears throat> e to grab items? Not yet. This guy had a facility built for kids to, you know, do their thing during the summer. Oh, no. Oh. Is, is this thing even recording? Okay. Okay. I'm going to back myself into a corner. They can't attack me in corners. But something is terribly wrong. Everyone, all... All the children and and the other employees, they vanished without a trace. I'm the I'm the only one left, and I don't understand why. I saw it. It's a creature, so horrifying it haunts my every waking thought. Its appearance it it, it defied all natural laws. It had eyes eyes in its mouth. Can you imagine? It's like a nightmare brought to life. I can't even begin to fathom its purpose or origin. Hello? That shadow, it was just here, right outside. It's out there, somewhere. You should probably shut the fuck up then. My God. Searching. Why am I whispering? What? Why is this happening? I need help. I need to reach out to someone, anyone who can explain this. If you're watching this, please send help. I'm trapped, terrified. I don't know how much longer I can hope. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. <laughs> My boy is gone. He is R.I.P. He was on his last life. Oh, you hold E. Did it say that? Did it say hold E or press E? Of course it said hold E. So Vanderbilt is abusing these kids. Or supposedly was abusing these kids. Um, and he somehow just disappeared when people started to investigate. What is happening? Why am I just pulling random boxes out of... What is this? Maybe if I actually try to play the game, I won't be so... These are cameras. Those are cameras. I figured it out. They're cameras. Okay. 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 All right. Get off the trash can. So this is where we are. These three cameras are these rooms here. I don't want to go into this room because I'm pretty sure that's... that's. Do I want to pull this? I'm assuming there's no power. Good, good, good. Um, if you're new to the channel, I have a saying around here. It goes, locked doors mean safety. Uh, in this situation, in this situation, locked doors mean safety. Um, in this situation, no power means safety. Am I to follow... Can I get some explanation as to why there are boxes in the filing cabinets? I'm just... Okay, whoa, hey, calm down there. I'm just a little curious. Especially if I can't open the boxes. I mean, I'm just, I'm just a little curious. I'm not, like, all the way curious, but I'm just a little curious. My biggest question when playing these games is, am I the parents or the child? Because we do... What am I supposed to do? What am I doing? Because we do um, find out that the parents, you know, are looking for their children. They're kind of confused as to 
why they dropped their kids off at this facility and then went to go pick them up and now they're all like Thanos snapped away. But am I playing as the parent searching for my child or am I the child trying to get out of here? Is my game broken? Is my I'm only to assume that my game is broken. Right? Or am I actually missing something? Because there's only four doors to go through in this place. One of them is locked. Okay, I don't... I, I legit don't know what I'm missing. Yet. And this is really unfortunate to say, but I feel like I'm going to have to start looking stuff up. Like, this can't be it. This isn't the whole demo, right? <laughs> or, I guess it's not necessarily even a demo. Like, what it... I don't know what I'm playing. It, yeah, I... Am I missing something? And it's not even like the security cameras are actually doing anything because I already picked up the camera in this room. That door is open. I moved the boxes over here. Pulling this switch does nothing for me. I don't know if it's supposed to activate something and I'm just, I'm not hearing it. But like nowhere did it ever display like, oh, I think the power's back on over here. I'm, I'm actually confused. Uh. <sighs> guys, guys, there's, there's a key in one of these, uh, I didn't see exactly which one it was, but you, you remember how I was just like fucking around with shit? Remember how, I was, yep, there's a, there's a goddamn key in one of these, one of these filing cabinets. And I just so happened to open all of the filing cabinets that only had boxes in them. And I didn't open a single filing cabinet that actually had... Let's move on, shall we? All right. All right, let's close this behind us. Because I don't want anything to sneak up on me. I don't want anything to kill me. I'm very subconscious about my life. About things taking it. Oh, 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 oh. Um... Maybe? Does it matter which one they go into? Okay. Maybe it does matter. Guys, I'm going to tell you right now, I am not <laughs> smart enough for this game. Uh, was the answer for this found somewhere? Oh, that's clever. Wait, that's clever. Okay, 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 okay. All right, all right. All right. Do the colors correlate? Yes, I think they do. So green is one. Hold on, hold on. Maybe I am smart enough for this game. Maybe I am smart enough. Green is one, red is two, three is yellow, four is purple. I am smart enough for this game. Two, or no, red was two, right? Three was yellow. I don't want to have to keep going in and out. This, <laughs> I'm a little too impatient for that. Five was blue. And that means that white is six. And that means that white is six. Uh, I'm going to close this behind me. Okay. I think we're done in this room. Cool, cool. I'm a technician, ma. Go, 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 go. Close the door behind me. I'm a very cautious man. All right, we're moving now. Told you guys I didn't need any help. I'm lying. Wooly bully. Nope, don't like that. I absolutely hate it. I absolutely hate it. Don't like it. Don't like it. Exit level B2. All right, good. Locked doors mean safety. Oh, hi. I don't have what you want right now. Um. But I'll come back later. Yeah, I'll come back later. Cool. This door across the hall locked? Yep. 
Something big's gonna come out of there. Something big is gonna come out of there. I have to assume that I am the kid, right? Or are we going to say that a kid is not smart enough? <coughs> Back myself into a corner. Oh. Hi there. If anyone is watching this, please listen carefully. Okay. My name is Ethan Jenkins. Ethan Winters? I work at Joyville. Something terrible has happened, and I, I, I don't have much time to explain. But there's something important you need to know about this teddy bear. This teddy bear is no ordinary toy. It has a special chip embedded in it. It's a lie. A chip that can do incredible things. It's, it's a long story. I, I can't risk revealing it on camera because I, I don't know who might find it, but. I can tell you this much. It opens doors. It has a purpose beyond that, but I can't go into detail right now. Cool. All right, Ethan Jenkins, let me tell you something. In the face of death, it doesn't fucking matter who's going to see your tape. Who's going to see this information that you're spreading? You're about to die. And if somebody is going to find this, that means that they're most likely in the same facility as you, and they're probably about to die as well. Which also means, right? Which also, you can close that now. Um, we don't need the elevator open anymore. Which also means that they're probably gonna wanna know the same information that you know. Can you, can you do the thing? Whoa, oh, no, 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 no. I don't like that. We don't need to go in there. There's several other places that we can explore. I mean, if we just like put enough weight on any of these doors, they'll open, you know? No, 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 no. Hello and welcome to Joyville. My name is Harrison Vanderbilt. Vanderbilt. At Joyville, we believe that childhood should be filled with laughter, exploration, and unforgettable memories. And we've crafted an experience like no other, tailored specifically to ignite the spark of joy in every child's heart. In Joyville, we believe in the power of imagination and the pure delight that toys can bring to children's lives. That's why we've curated toys that will transport your little ones into a realm of limitless wonder and joy. So whether you're a parent seeking a transformative summer experience for your child, or a guardian searching for a safe and engaging environment, look no further than Joyville. Join us in creating memories that will last a lifetime. Come and discover the unparalleled joy that awaits in our marvelous children. See, why do you have to be like that? Why can't you be normal? Why can't you just be fucking normal? Joyville fun and prizes. Is that bingo or the lottery? Because bingo usually has a free space and it's like five by five, not six by six. That's six by five. I'm stupid. Did I also mention that math is also not my strong suit? I love Joyville. It's the best place for games and fun. Thanks, Sabrina. Nobody asked. I'm so happy that we have such a cool entertainment complex. Laura. Guess what, Laura? You're dead now. I love carousels. Guess what, uh, random kid? I'm pretty sure that carousel killed you. It was so cool. Tom. Well, guess what? <laughs> These are a lot of rules. Enjoy the entertainment in a safe and friendly atmosphere. Woo! That is a lot of reading. Took a ticket. My ticket to ride. Do I have a crouch button? Oh, it's the fucking control button. I hate that button for crouch. I will mention this every single time it is the crouch button in a video game. Crouching, I don't know. I, I don't know. I always felt like Minecraft had it right in that the shift button should be 
Oh, oh, oh. No, 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 no. Where exactly am I going? What is... What is... What is my objective? Do I take fall damage? Do I want to find out? Fuck it. It's a video game. Well... Okay. I, that also probably wasn't enough height <laughs> for fall damage. I always felt like Minecraft had it right in that the shift button should be crouch. And every other game that uses control as a crouch button is wrong. I do not like the control button as a crouch button. It's so weird for my fingers to have to break in half like that. Sorry, I normally don't do all this complaining. <laughs> I'm going to try not to compare it to Poppy Playtime, like at all. Um... Or not as much, I will say. But like this area definitely does give me the vibes from chapter two of Poppy Playtime where we were in the the what was it called? The play place. Where we had to play the games for mommy long legs. Wait. Wait. Oh. I'm so confused. I really don't know what's happening right now. They took the charge out of my bear? What am I doing? I have my ticket, right? I grabbed the ticket. Insert the ticket to play Joy Wheel and have a lot of fun. Good luck. Okay, cool. So I played it. I saw the wheel spin and it didn't do shit. What? What am I? Oh, I'm getting frustrated. I'm getting frustrated. Like, this is a good game. I think I I haven't played long enough to really know for sure. It's beautiful. It looks good. It runs smoothly, but there is not a lot of direction as to where the fuck I'm going. I can't climb up the slide. I tried that already. I have walked around this entire area and not a single thing. There's not a single thing I can do. These computers don't work. This, th this is inactive. I can't hop into one of the carts and like the, the light go from red to green. And I'm sure, I guarantee you this is just a me problem. Nobody else has had issues with this game except me. I promise you it is just me. I haven't seen any other playthroughs of this, but I, I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure it is just me who's having problems finding out where to go. Hey, you're trying to make a rainbow? Roy G. Biv. Red, orange, yellow, green, blue. But that's an extra color on the rainbow. Uh, wait, can I? Can I? No! What the fuck? And then I have to start from way back here? I have to start from way back here? <laughs> Why do you do this? So whether you're a parent seeking a transformative summer experience for your child, or a guardian searching for a safe and engaging environment, look no further than Joyville. Join us in creating memories that will last a lifetime. All right, orange theoretically would be the next color. Okay. Yellow would theoretically be the next color. Okay. 
Green? See, this is unfortunate for the people who don't know the colors of the rainbow. Roy G. Biv Blue? Blue Indigo Violet. Okay. What? Wait! Wait! Ow! That's creepy. Okay. This would be the next color, right? Don't kill me. No! 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 Where's blue? That is blue! Unless this is blue. I mean, it is blue, but like... Okay. Indigo. Uh... Indigo is like a darker blue, right? Okay. And then violet would be purple. <laughs> don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me. <laughs> Alright, I'll catch you later. I'm gonna fall with you. Can I get you for a thumbnail? Can I, can I, <laughs> can I get you for a thumbnail? Alright. Um, so let me just stop right here and just say that, yes, it does feel like it's very hard to find where, where to go and what to do next. Cause like I was searching around the entire area trying to figure out what to do. I was, I was going around this entire place and I knew that I put my ticket in. I knew that this thing like lit up, but I didn't know that I was supposed to be interacting with it because most games, and I guess this is on me for... I don't know. I'd have to check and see how other people have felt about this, but it should have like a press E to use if it is usable. Like the the interact, the, the cursor just flashes when it's something that you can interact with. And that's not always noticeable, I guess. But a press E to use every time something is interactable is a lot better than a flashing cursor. There's nothing wrong with a flashing cursor. It's new. It's different. Um ah! <laughs> It's new and it's different. Um but I I just think press E to use would be a lot easier for what to do and where to go next. Also that killed me. I knew something was going to happen. I knew something was either going to pop up at me or I was going to fall through and it still scared the shit out of me. Wow. Wow. We're getting into the creepy really fast. Oh. Press F for flashlight on and off. Cool. Got it. Oh. Hi. Hi. Be gone, demon! Be gone, demon! Oh, why do you make that noise? Left or right? I'm right-handed, so normally I would go right, but the monster just went... Oh, I was stepping on the squishy. Oh, that's why. I'm gonna go left, because the monster went right. Please, nothing jump out at me. I'm just a poor soul. No, I've gotta be the parent. I have to be the parent, because, I mean, yeah, kids are smart enough to know, like, this and that and that and this, but, the kind of things that I've had to do, I don't think a kid would be very good at. Come at me, bitch. Come at me, bitch. Yeah, you're scared. You're scared. Oh. Uh... I don't like the noises that the ground is making, and I'm going to politely ask you to stop. Oh, I didn't even see that one up there. <laughs> Why would I want to turn my flashlight off? Is that is it going to drain my battery? Is it going to waste battery if I don't turn it off? Pull the... Oh, there's no... There's no lever on that. Pull the switch! Alright, so I'm, I'm here to assume that this is either a charging station for my bear or for my flashlight. And considering that the flashlight doesn't have an indicated battery, it is for my bear. There's a lever. 
There's a lever. But it has no power. It has no charge. So what am I supposed to do with this? Can I quickly put it in there? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. All right. And see, at this point, you've lost me. Because if I have 0% charge, how am I supposed to use the bear? Or was that on me for placing the bear in the, uh, in the, in the port with the rainbow section? Uh, it's only me. It's only me that this kind of stuff happens to. Can I stack these boxes? Oh my god, I think I can. Am I supposed to stack the boxes? I'm probably not, but we're gonna try it. <gasps> oh! 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 Lock doors mean safety? Cool, cool, cool. Oh! Look at that. I figured it out. <laughs> How the hell am I supposed to pull them both at the same time? Go, 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 go. There we go. Now give me my charge back, bitch. Please, nothing come out at me. I am simply just trying to charge my teddy bear. Yeah, this is going to get me killed later on in the game. It's stuff like this that makes me think if there's going to be a second, like, chapter or a second game, these are the kind of mechanics that get you killed. Perfect. Give him back. Give him back. Thank you. Nope, 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 nope. He doesn't need to be charged anymore. He doesn't need to be charged anymore! Oh, my lord. We gotta give our teddy bear a name. Assuming that there is more to come after this. Sector D, Sector C, Sector A, and Sector B. Not necessarily in that order. Um, no. I probably shouldn't just go willy-nilly opening doors. That doesn't sound like a very smart idea. But you know, nobody ever said that I was a smart guy. So I'm going to make not-so-smart decisions. Yeah. Not sure what being able to open up these doors was supposed to do, but here we go. Up to the game room. I don't know. Maybe it's me. Maybe it's the game, but there's something there's something like that's hard to follow about all of this. Evil. Oh. Can we not? Can we not? Um, can we not? Should I have? Was I supposed to? Can we not? Can we turn the lights back on? Oh, I forgot I had a flashlight. Bitch. <laughs> okay, we're good. Everything's dandy. We are A-OK. -okay. Ronnie. So Ronnie is the name of one of the snakes. So we got Wooly Bully. We got Ronnie. Oh, we're over the, um, we're over the play place now. Oh. How about we don't go down there just yet? How about we don't? Moray. Morty? Is that Morty or Moray? Yeah, there's something about this game that just... It, I don't want to be critical or anything, but like... It's kind of hard for me to... Follow what's going on or where to go or what to do next. Don't jump out of me! Don't jump out! Don't jump out! You're a bitch. You're a bitch if you do. Should I have come down here? 
Oh, these doors are open now. I'm making a run for it. I'm making a run for it. I'm not running very fast. Okay, uh, I'm, I'm making a run for it. Can I hit you for a thumbnail? Thanks. Uh, where am I supposed to go? Making a run for it. Making a run for it. Making a run for it. No! <laughs> <laughs> I'm dying. Why does it start you so far back? Why is that a thing that you have to do? Why do I have so many problems with this game? All right, before I get chased again, I'm gonna assess where I'm supposed to go. I'm gonna assess my exit options because that was bullshit. I mean, truthfully with the power out, there's really nowhere I can go. All right, you can't scare me again. Oh, how do you manage to scare me twice? You fucking bitch! Alright, am I supposed to hop back into the slide? Cause like, his big ass can't fit in here. Hey, buddy! Hey! Yeah! Yeah, fat ass! All right, he's gone now. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right, that was fun. But let's never do that again. Let's let's try to avoid doing something like that like ever again. Thank you. Try again. Try what again? Try try what again? See, everything feels so random. Ball pit! Oh, come on. It doesn't make the... <laughs> you know, like a ball pit sound makes? Yeah, sometimes I choose to make practical sound effects instead of just putting in my own. Hang on. Hang on. Boom. Oh... Well, I wasn't standing on the fucking platform when it went up. Jesus, crimity. I also, uh, I do not want to be critical of this game, but there's just so many things that actually bug me. I don't like the idea of having to hold E while I am moving something because then my fingers, it, it hurts my fingers. It hurts. Okay. All right. Now what is this? What did that do? Okay. I'm sorry. What? Oh no, 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 no! I was supposed to bring that over here, put that there, and then bring that over there because that was gonna stay. It's fine. Where does this go? Does this go anywhere? That does nothing. Oh my god. Oh my lord. It's gonna be a while before I make progress. Oh. No, grab it, grab it, grab it. Go, 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 go. Uh. Okay. Now, what did that do? Mm-hmm. Okay. Cool. So in, in my mind, I was thinking that when the yellow hits the yellow, that the platform would extend and then it would stay extended. Um, but that doesn't seem like the case at all. So how 
How am I supposed to get? Hmm. Hang on. Hang on. Got it. Okay. All right. And then we, and then we take red, right? And then we take red. But now the thing about. All right. All right. Okay. Okay. Cool. All right. I'm starting to get it. Right. So check this. Check it. Check it. Check it. So we take that off. And then we put red. Guys, it takes a while for my brain to actually start working. But when it works, it works. So we, we take that. We get on the platform. And then we take the red. Right? Are you watching? Are you paying attention? Are you catching the vibes? Okay. Look at that. Da -da -da -da! Oh. N why? Evil. Why do you have to get... Why do you have to make things so difficult? Alright guys, check this out, check this out. Boom. Grab it. Grab that. Watch this, watch this, watch this. Boom. Uh, maybe? Hello? Oh. This is very frustrating. I don't know if you guys were aware of this, but this is indeed very frustrating. Uh, why'd you turn the lights off? Why'd you turn the lights off? Can we talk about why you turned the lights off? Oh boy. This is taking a lot more brain power than I thought it was going to. Wow. This is ridiculous. Um... Please nothing jump out at me. Please. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. So I have been struggling for, I feel like 30 minutes, 30, 40 minutes trying to figure out this fucking puzzle. And it's, I don't know. I, I'm pretty sure it's literally just me because I am overthinking. Either I'm overthinking or I'm not thinking hard enough, but these puzzles are really fucking hard. But I got it. I figured it out. All right, I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I'm going. I'm escaping. Wahoo! 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 Ah! Cool. Got it. I didn't want to go that way anyways. Looks like bullshit down there. Oh. What? Mm-mm. What do you want from me? I don't want. You want me to go back upstairs? Is that what you want? You know, I'm not scared. I'm not scared. I may sound like a little bitch, but I'm not scared. Okay, I'm scared. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I know I made you look like a fool. And that was not my intent. You look good. You look like a very fashionable. Oh. I'm not running fast enough. 
This is not me running fast enough. No, oh, you bitch! Ah! I have been at this for an hour and 27 minutes. Why is it that I've only ever seen, like, when, when I looked up the game, right? I looked up the game and I, I looked up, like, how many people were playing it and how popular it had been and how recently uploads were and all of the videos I had seen were like 30 to 45 minutes. Why have I been recording for an hour and a half? Am I that stupid? What the fuck is this? Why am I in the sewers now? Is he still chasing me? Oh, okay. He's still chasing me. Um, hello? <laughs> you, you, you've got to be fucking kidding me. Seven, zero, five. Oh! <laughs> okay. Okay, hang on, because I think I've got something. I'm th I think I'm on to something. There are numbers on the sewer walls, and I'm assuming that those are the numbers that I'm supposed to enter into the keypad if I have the fucking time to do so. And I think that they've changed every time. So I'm gonna get back there, and I'm gonna try and see if that's what I'm supposed to do. But I don't know, because nothing is explicitly explained in this game. So it's two, zero three and then the last number should be two zero three two zero three two zero three two zero three three okay 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 two zero three three enter i don't have the time i i don't have the time to type in those numbers i, I can't see shit i i can't see i simply cannot see the keypad i do not have the time to enter in the numbers on the keypad because the thing is right behind me. Seven, seven, six, six, enter. Oh my lord, fucking finally. Now where am I going? <sighs> oh, I'm done. I'm, I'm done. I, I literally cannot. I, I've literally, I've been at this for an hour and 34 minutes. An hour and 34 minutes. And that's just me playing the game itself. That's not even how long it's taken me to finish this this section. This little section, I... <laughs> I'm going crazy. I'm actually going insane. I'm actually losing it. Because there's no reason. There's absolutely no reason why it should be taking me this long. There's no reason why I should be losing and why I should be like, fucking up this easily I'm going to show you exactly why this is such a problem I'm gonna show you exactly why I'm having such a problem with this first of all the run is not fast enough I'm not running fast enough to actually get away from this thing so when I do get to the key card or the keypad he's already right behind me because then it takes me for fucking ever to type in the passcode so okay it's eight eight two Four. So we're gonna type in eight 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 two four. The door will open, and he's right behind me. Before I get to the elevator, he's gonna kill me. Watch this. Watch. Oh, now you don't want to do it. Now you don't want to do it. Oh! <laughs> this is my personal hell. Yeah, you know what? Whatever, whatever possibly thinks that it can kill me. I am so not afraid of you anymore. Oh, here we go. We're going down.
Okay. All right. Let me. Let me have a word to word with you guys. Let me have a conversation. Let me have a. Let's have a talk. So. This game is not a bad game. I enjoyed it. The concept of it is great. It gives me heavy Poppy Playtime vibes. Like I said, I don't want to be that guy to compare one game to another, but it was, it was clearly what it was going for. It's a facility meant for kids to have fun uh, and then things go south. You know, the, the mascot is, is it's got some some loose screws, uh, clearly sentient test subject kind of thing. But the mechanics of the game Cud Plays, I think, is what it was called, the, the company. Um, in the next game, please make the run faster. Um, make it more explicitly obvious. Don't change that. Don't change this little beat right here. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. Make it more explicitly obvious as to what you're interacting with. Because... I, it, I really felt stupid because of how long it took me to figure something out that was in plain sight, but I didn't know I was supposed to interact with. I saw that I inserted the ticket and the wheel spun and like all the colors were flashing, but I didn't know that I was supposed to pick a pedal, pick the color on the pedal. It just on, on the sign, it says insert your ticket to play, what was it, uh, joy wheel and have fun, good luck. That didn't tell me any instructions or anything. It didn't say press E to use. I feel like a press E to use would definitely help with furthering what you can interact with and like this and that. I don't know, again, I'm not trying to shit on the game. I thought it was great. I probably wasn't doing something right. I It took me forever to solve that puzzle with the blocks. I think the game actually could have done without that whole block section, but it was good. I enjoyed it as frustrated as it may have seemed like I was getting as tired of this game. Uh, it may have seemed that I, I was getting. I did enjoy this. I'm not going to lie to you when I say that I probably would have stopped playing halfway through the video if I thoroughly were not enjoying this. I wanted to see it through. I wanted to see what was going to happen. I knew that it was going to end on a cliffhanger. Because games like this, especially in the year 2023, we've had a great year for indie horror games and, and video games and movies in general. Um, so I was very excited to get into this. But man, are the controls very hard to get a grasp of. Holding E while, the, while items are in your hands, holding E to hold an item or to carry something is the most frustrating mechanic ever. Just, just press E. Just press E to hold, press E to let go. Press E to hold, press E to let go. I don't want to have to hold E and then hold W because there were times when I was holding E and I was moving forward. And during that block section, I was holding E to grab the yellow block so that I can take it over to the bridge, over to the bridge that, you know, slides in and out. And I would hold W. I don't know. It was, it's a brain thing. It's a mental thing, but it's just some of the controls are very frustrating. That's all I will leave it with. Make the run a little bit faster, please. Either that or make the monster a little bit slower in the moments where you have to punch in information into a keypad while being chased. Make things explicitly uh, more obvious that you're interacting with it and change that hold E to, uh, hold e to pick up. Just make it a press. Other than that, I did enjoy it. Jump scares, absolutely phenomenal. The atmosphere was great. I felt very terrified. I'm excited to see where the story goes. What more with Joyville we can figure out. Um, I'm going to get out of here. I'm going to go take a shower. I'm, I'm sweaty. I'm hot. <laughs> I love you guys. Stay safe out there. Take it easy. And big buddy out. Hey, that is the best part of this theme song.